matchup for you tonight. Sheldon Hinton taking on Paul Trill out of Vancouver, British Columbia. The second bout of the evening is scheduled for four rounds in the heavyweight division. The referee for this bout is Brian Bernhardt. Your judges at ringside are Usman Ali, William Warwick Jr., and Dave Delisikowicz. Introducing in the blue corner, weighing in at 209 pounds, wearing the black trunks and with a professional record of zero wins and one loss, from Vancouver, British Columbia, Paul Trill. And introducing in the red corner, he weighed in at 246 pounds. Wearing the black trunks with silver and gold trim, with a professional record of four wins and three losses, from Edmonton, Alberta, prime time, Sheldon. Referee Brian Bernhardt will give the gentlemen their final instructions. Have a knockdown, direct you to your neutral corner, stay there until otherwise you're directed. Good luck to you both. So this is Tyrell's first, the second fight, and he's facing the exact same guy, Tony. Uh, obviously, for a second professional fight, Fox. he's he's must be fully prepared because he's taking on a guy he's seen before. The thing about Paul Tyrell, he's had no amateur well, background that's, where. That's, Sheldon Hinton had a, had a lot of amateur fights. He's very green, Tyrell, but he's in good shape. From Sheldon Hinton's standpoint, is, is it smart for him to take on a guy again that he just beat recently? Well, it is and it isn't. Sometimes you, when you fight a guy that you fought before, the thing is to stop him. He went the distance the last time. I, I'm sure that Sheldon's looking for a knockout. Well, this fight is only scheduled for four rounds. I'm James Monsace along with Tony Pep. Nowhere to hide is the name of the card, and there's nowhere to hide for these two gentlemen tonight as they face each other for the second time in their careers. Good Tyrell. right hand right there by Sheldon Hinton. Hold on. Punch out, guys. Punch out. Tyrell punch out, being punch the aggressor, which is strange. Ty uh, Hinton's got some size on him. Hinton using a good jab. Kind of typical with the heavyweights. We see that both guys are being fairly patient here in round one, even though it is a four-rounder. Yeah, the heavyweights, they move a little slower, but they got dynamite in both fists. Good right hand by Tyrell. Good right hand. Tyrell working good. For a guy with no amateur experience, he basically has had only one fight in his entire life inside the ring, and that's his last fight. I know it comes from your same hometown, Vancouver. Uh, what would ever possess a guy to just to jump into the ring with uh, no amateur background? Well, Paul, what, looking at Paul, what his, fir his first forte was going, he was a mixed martial arts fighter who got into boxing. He was doing some mixed martial arts, got a chance to do some boxing, hoping that it would help his mixed martial arts. Fought uh, Sheldon and, 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 and enjoyed it. He actually wanted to come back. He asked for the rematch. So they obliged. Well, he got it. He has his opportunity tonight in front of uh, Sheldon Hinton's hometown crowd again. Good combination by Hinton. Good, good body good. shot. Good body shot by Paul. And good body shot by Top Paul. Four, right, five, right hook. Six, was it below the belt? No. It was a good shot. Eight, the fight's over. Nine, Excellent punch. Excellent punch. Paul Tyrell wins by knockout. Paul Tyrell wins by a knockout. Sheldon Hinton must be disappointed. It was a fantastic, well, it was let's, a fantastic uh, punch. Let's see. take a look at this, Tony, because uh, I want to get a good look at it again. It happened so quick. Right here, you see Sheldon being the aggressor. But there oh. it is, good, good left hook to the body, right to the liver. Yeah. Excellent, right on the button. I remember uh, that punch. That was a punch that put down, uh, put down Scotty Olson when I've he got fought Paul Michael Tyrell Carvajal. He's standing up to me. He told me in the airplane that a left hook was his best punch. I guess he showed it tonight. 
Well, still on the canvas is Sheldon Hinton. He uh, he took a major shot there from that gentleman right there who picks up his first knockout. Here we go with another replay of the shot. It was a nice left hook right to the liver. Bam, right there. Yep. I don't care how big you are or how strong you are, that is definitely an equalizer. You punch a guy in the liver, how big, how strong. Same punch that knocked Oscar De La Hoya out against Bernard Hopkins. Exact same punch. Hopefully uh, Sheldon Hinton is okay. Well, he's still down on the canvas, and they're not going to let him up until uh, we've got a doctor in the ring, and they're taking a look at Hinton, and uh, Hinton's now he's up. getting up. Hinton's now he's up. getting up, so. Atta boy. So he's okay. If you look at Hinton, he's a big guy, but he looks a little bit soft around the midrib area, and that's where he got hit. I guess it's back to the drawing board. He can't say anything about this fight. Good win for Paul Tyrell. All right, well, let's go up to our ring announcer, Dean Panis. He's got the official results, and uh, we'll go to Dean, and he can give us all the details. Well, ladies and gentlemen, before we get our decision, how about another round of applause for Sheldon Hinton? <laughs> Referee Brian Bernhardt stops his vote at 2 minutes and 34 seconds of the first round. Your winner by knockout.